Everyone, this is Sherry. Welcome to I Can Has Draw. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to draw a cute Chihuahua cartoon. Begin by drawing a loose circle on your paper, like so. Next, draw a curved vertical line, and then you're going to draw a curved horizontal line. This is to show what direction the Chihuahua's face will be pointing. This is going to be a three quarters view. And next, uh, draw the snout of the Chihuahua. I'm starting by uh, drawing a circle where the snout will connect to the head. And it's going to look kind of like a, um, it's going to be cylindrical, but it's going to be more pointed towards where the nose goes. Now I'm going to add the neck to the head. And I'm going to make the top of the head a little bit rounder since Chihuahua's um, features, you know, what they're known for, those really large foreheads. And I'm drawing the ears with just uh, basic triangle shapes. I think it'd be fun to have one kind of lopsided ear there, so. There we go. Next, I'm drawing the eyes. The bottom of the eye is going to rest on that horizontal line, very close to where the snout is. And now I'm going to divide the snout in the half where the nose will be lined up. I'm going to go ahead and throw that nose in real quick. Now I'm going to add the mouth. Since this is a cartoon chihuahua, I'm not going for a whole lot of realism. I want to capture the essence of happy dog. So I'm making a really curvy smile here. And then finishing off the chin. And I want to include the jaw too. Next I'm going to draw in the pupils for the eyes. Very happy looking chihuahua here. Add a little bit of length to the snout where the bridge is. And I'm going to go ahead and add in the brow bone of the chihuahua. Make that forehead a little bit higher. Refining the ear shape a bit. Getting it closer to how I want it to look. I'm sorry about that. That was a bug that happened to fly in front of the camera. They really like the lights I have hanging onto my desk. I'm going to refine the eye shape just a little bit. Dogs don't have a perfectly round eye. They're kind of like a slight triangular shape. Very, very slight. Just a hint of it. Now I'm going to add the collar for this cute little chihuahua. I'm making the collar look kind of big and chunky to um, make the chihuahua look even more petite. I might change it later though, depending on how I feel as the image gets closer to finalization. I'm going back and refining the shape of the head again and the nose. Mm, 
I'm not so sure about that mouth. I think I'll keep it the way it was. Sometimes you'll want to do that. You just want to try something different and experiment before you do your final inking and that's perfectly okay. I'm going to erase all these other um, guidelines here. It's probably getting a little confusing to see now. So I'm going to erase those and just keep what I'm planning on using for the final image. And I know it probably looks redundant, but I am going over all my lines just to make sure I got them just right. Um, because once I outline everything with permanent ink, there's no going back. So I want to make sure I have it all memorized, so to speak. So I'm pretty pleased with how this is turning out. I feel ready to start outlining. I like to start at the very top of the drawing and work my way down. One point to the next. Nice and smooth. Just looking at this chihuahua makes me feel happy. That's a good sign. If your drawing makes you feel happy, if it's smiling at you enough or you feel happy, then I'd say that's a successful drawing. Or any emotion, really. If you have a drawing of something sad and you feel sad, then you successfully accomplished conveying that emotion. And last, outline the heart. Ta-da! I'm going to go and add in those whisker dots. And now it's time to erase all the pencil lines. Thank you, pencil lines. You were useful and now you are no longer needed. Now that that's done, I'm going to go and fill in the darkest parts of the drawing, such as the eyes. You can choose to fill in the eyes with a dark brown because that's what most dog eyes look like. But black is fine too. And I'm going to color in the nose of this chihuahua a black. I'm going to outline the mouth just a little bit with a sharpie marker. Next I'm going to take my pencil and put in some values, shade a little bit. This will help the dog have a little bit more form, it won't look so two-dimensional or flat. And 
and I'm going in really lightly with my pencil I'm not going in hard so when you're shading make sure you start off light and work your way uh, darker and darker until it's just how you want it and if you feel like you did it too dark just get your eraser and erase it back It's usually a little bit of shading around uh, where the mouth and the nose meet. So I'll do that. And I'm just going in here and touching things up a little bit at a time. I'm not rushing this. I want to make sure I get it just right. Shadowing under the head there, under the jaw. There we go really cute so there you have it how to draw a cute cartoon chihuahua thank you guys for watching the video if you liked this video tutorial then please check out the channel subscribe share with your friends and remember you can has draw